as you're getting ready for your marriage to, to come, um, well, what are your feelings towards the, the day? <laughs> like, like, are you nervous that you'll get everything ready in time? Oh. Yeah, I, I know me. I'm a, I'm a good little planner. I might procrastinate a bit on a couple of things, but uh -huh. it'll get done. So. <laughs> um, no, I'm not, I'm not really nervous about the planning of it all. That's not, I like planning things. So it's actually been really fun. It's been a little stressful because mm -hmm. there's a lot of, different little parts that go into it that you never really thought about, which apparently like, apparently like having a scent, like a wedding, <laughs> what? Scent. It's a wedding scent, it's a thing you do apparently, it's where like the bride gets a scent, like a perfume that she nev has never worn before, so the groom has like never like smelled it on her before or whatever, and so it's like only tied to their wedding, like it's just a connection to the wedding day. Wacky. Yeah, and it's like, I don't wear perfume normally, uh -huh. <laughs> so, okay. If you could say, like, top five worst things about wedding planning, or top three, just three things, no particular order, just, like, the most annoying things about so wedding planning. So far? Yes. That I've experienced, so far that I've experienced is finding a caterer that's not trying to, like, take you for a ride, just, like, with all the crazy fees that really shouldn't be there. Mm -hmm. um, and then <laughs> the registry, picking the registry was stressful because that every, we finally, we finally got it done. But like towards in the beginning, every single time we mentioned the registry, we started like having little spats because my idea of what is necessary for our household <laughs> is not the same as what he thinks is necessary. Like what? Like, like with, um, I, we, we both got to put this on the registry, but I really valued the importance of having colorful wine glasses. <laughs> <laughs> I like rainbow hues in it, you know? And he really wanted a nice knife set for the kitchen. So. One time I was at TJ Maxx with my mom, and we passed by these rainbow cutlery stuff. This, like, mm. it, it, it's like a cool, like, metallic rainbow color. And I was like, when I get an apartment, that is what I'm going to have in it. My roommate one of my roommates had that when we moved in but there's only like one knife i don't know where all the other ones are <laughs> it's just the one just one just one so that's you need a few things what is, what is the the registry like what service does that go through so <laughs> if you want to donate. <laughs> yeah i'll just put the link in the show notes so anyone who wants to can donate um we have a honeymoon fund too if you want to that'd be nice um but anyways i'm kidding anyway <laughs> if you want to i'll put that in there i mean we have like three listens per episode so i don't know how generous people will be but sure. um i mean okay no i um we are doing it through the knot which is like one of like the big wedding companies that have like all these different guides and planners and like help you kind of they have like an app mm -hmm. and then like helps you with the process and gives you like a countdown and checklists and all that nonsense um so you can set up a website and you can set up a registry on it and you can link different stores and that kind of thing on it or they have their own registry platform that they have like with different brands that partner and you can just kind of pick and choose what you want on it whoa yeah i never really think about the whole industry behind it because it's a big industry no it's it's like okay so if i went into a bakery and I wanted a birthday cake. Mm -hmm. And I said I wanted like a three-tier birthday cake with like edible flowers and blah, 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 blah. And then if I went in and got the same exact birthday, like birthday cake, if I went and got the same exact cake but said it was a wedding cake, it like jacks the price up. <laughs> like crazy because you slapped the word wedding on there. Uh -huh. Even though it's the same cake that you would do for like a birthday, it's, yeah. Have you considered buying a birthday cake but with nothing on it? And then just writing happy wedding. <laughs> um, so I actually, we're actually only doing like a one tier cake that's going to be like this big. This big. <laughs> that's 
that's it? Well, yeah, maybe a little bigger. Mm -hmm. But, yeah, no. No. It's one tier. It's small. It's a small cake. Because we don't really eat cake. We're going to have an ice cream bar instead. Oh. <gasps> Delish. That's the plan anyways. But his neighbor, his, uh, his mom's house, or like his house, they have, she makes all these sorts of bakery things and whatever. And she actually made our engagement cake. It was really pretty. So she's going to do her, do her cake. Groovy. 